So you can't help me? I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. Is everything okay? Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. Rachel was nothing like Kate. And Principal Wells said you had something on your mind you wouldn't tell him. You care to share? Not right now. I'll tell you everything as soon as I figure it out. I'd like to believe that, Max. It just seems like there's a lot of drama around you this week. Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello? Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. <laughs> 